Go high level. Is it legit? Is it Ponzu? Or is it oversold hype? These days, it seems like everybody and their mother is promoting Go High Level. Shut up and buy Go High Level. But why is that? With the 40% affiliate playoff plan, it's hard to determine if people are promoting Go High Level because it's actually good or because it's going to pay them a nice, solid, reoccurring paycheck. But before we get into that, to understand Go High Level, you need to understand the SMMA space and software that was used before it existed. Now, way back in the day when Ty Lopez dominated the social media marketing space, yes, I'm that old you had to use about seven or eight different softwares to not even accomplish what go high level can do today by itself and let me just give you a few examples here to build an email list you needed a tool like active campaign aweber or mailchimp back in the day to build a landing page you needed something like click funnels or lead pages or even wix to build a website you needed to also use wix i don't even think wix was a landing page builder back in these days links you needed to use a link shortener like bitly to get bookings and keep a schedule you need to use something like calendly to do social media postings at mass you needed to use a tool like hootsuite if you wanted to build a crm you had to use a tool like pipe drive if you wanted to collect surveys and quizzes you had to use a tool like lead form and by the way none of this allows you to do two-way sms communications all the tools that i just told you about did not include two-way SMS communication, which is an absolute game changer when it comes to marketing. And I say this from experience because before I ever ran a SaaS MMA business, I ran a six-figure consulting firm that was unrelated to SaaS or SMMA. And I eventually consolidated a bunch of softwares that I was using into Go High Level for that business. And I actually have screenshots here of my Zapier account of all the different accounts and things that I tested and tried with that particular business before I inevitably made the switch to Go High Level, which is what prompted me to eventually start building my SaaS MMA business. As I started using Go High Level for my first business, it started to really open my eyes to the potential that Go High Level gave for SaaS and SMMA agencies. Because like I mentioned earlier, all these different softwares, and even from my own experience, you know, these four to six softwares that I was using, those really started to stack up. I mean, you're talking about, you know, 500 to 1,000, maybe even in some cases, $2,000 worth of software expenses just to have all the same features that pretty much Go High Level has to offer. And so what Go High Level actually did is pretty genius. GHL saw an opportunity in the market and they have absolutely capitalized on that. What I really admire about Go High Level is how they were able to differentiate themselves in the space of internet marketing tools when you have companies like ClickFunnels that have such a massive moat and such a cult-like following that they were able to carve themselves out a niche even within the online market marketing tools, it's been really cool to see how they differentiated themselves from ClickFunnels, as well as a lot of the other softwares that I mentioned earlier that are in the space as well. Because it's no doubt that Russell Brunson is one of the goats of internet marketing. I still read his material to this day while using Go High Level. And so the question is, how was Go High Level able to become such a dominant player in such a dominated industry by companies like ClickFunnels? Well, when you look at the dirty details, you actually find that they did the complete opposite of what companies like ClickFunnels do. You see, from what I observed, ClickFunnels really has a focus on the coaching, consulting, and personal branding space. In this day and age, everybody thinks that you have to build an online brand in order to make a ton of money or that you have to start a personal brand to make a ton of money. And while that's absolutely true, it's definitely not the only way that you can amass tons of wealth. You see, what Go High Level realized was that there was an under underserved part of the ClickFunnels community that was serving an underserved part of the economy. And that's small and medium sized businesses, which by the way, aren't actually that small. According to the SBA, which is the Small Business Administration here in the United States, a small business is any business that has less than 500 employees. Let me say that again, 500 employees. And there's over 33 million businesses that are considered that fall under this small business category here in America. And what Go High Level realized was that these agency owners who were serving this underserved industry and who are underserved by softwares like ClickFunnels, they were getting massively screwed and leaving tons of money on the table. 
So what Go High Level ultimately did was they positioned themselves as the partner of agencies for small to medium sized local businesses. They carved out a niche within an already dominated industry, which is a big lesson that you can learn as a business owner is how can you find a new outlook on something that's being dominated? Somebody that's been able to do this very well is also Alex Ramosi, who also proved that serving local and medium-sized businesses is a great and untapped way to build massive wealth. So what Go High Level ultimately did for the SMMA space is a few things. It gave social media marketing agencies a powerful all-in-one tool to streamline a lot of the services that they provide while allowing them to capture and retain a lot more profit than they would selling other softwares. It streamlined the entire capture, nurture, and convert process that is required in today's attention-based economy. And another big thing that they've been able to do is unify communication, blending the line between automation and human conversation. And so this is something that I'd personally never seen put together so well before I started using Go High Level. And while yes, it's not perfect, it's definitely better than anything else that I've seen on the market at the time. And as I started using Go High Level for my original business, it started to open my eyes to the true potential of SaaS and SMMA and what it had to offer. And since then, in about two and a half, three months, I've been able to personally scale my business to over $8,000 in monthly reoccurring revenue. So if you've been concerned Considering starting a SaaS or an SMMA, I've actually built a Discord with nearly 500 members that focuses on building the hybrid of those two. Because it's a big debate in the SMMA and SaaS world these days about what's better. By the way, if you think I should make a video on addressing that, drop a comment. And if you got value from this video like I trust you did, go ahead and hit the thumbs up and I'll see you inside the Discord.